All right, guys. Um, so those people at home, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, if I don't see you, which I am not going to. And everybody else here, good morning. So what we're doing at school today, can I have your attention here, everybody? What we're doing at school today is we're wrapping up all the late work, and then I have a lab that we're going to do. I'll post that in a little bit. So uh, we're talking about continental drift, plate tectonics. And so what we're going to do today, guys, is if you're done with Pangea and you're caught up with everything, you're going to do a lab, okay? And we have three things that you're going to use, all right? One is going to be a Rice Krispie bar. It looks like this. One is going to be a graham cracker that looks like that. Peter, right here. Okay. What would each of these represent if we're talking about plate tectonics? Um, okay, crust, right? Yep. Yeah. So we, this is the Rice Krispie. This is the RC. This is the Graham's cracker. Both are Rice Krispie and Graham cracker. Okay, so uh, what would the thicker one represent? Yeah, that's the Rice Krispie. What does the Rice Krispie represent? Dude, we just said that they're crust. Think about the crust. Well, what type, what's the bigger part of the crust? Continental, that's right. So this is the continental. Okay, continental crust. Then what would the graham cracker represent? Oceanic, yeah, this is the oceanic. Now, we're going to do one third thing. One other thing that you're going to have is you're going to have these sitting on a bed of magma. Liquid magma. Okay, liquid magma. So what we got that I'm going to use and people at home can do it differently. This stuff right here. You guys can look at me in the classroom. It works better. Okay, we've got whipped cream, frosting, funfetti, vanilla, frosting. Okay. And then, like I said, we've got Rice Krispie treats. Those people at home, if you want me to provide them, I can. Just have to have somebody pick that up. And then the other thing that we got down here in my bag are graham crackers. Okay, so I have a lab that once you're done with everything, <clears throat> what you're gonna do is you're going to be working on these and having them either move together, move apart, or slide next to each other. And you're gonna have different types of graham crackers. Maybe at one point you're going to have a Rice Krispie and a Rice Krispie. Maybe at one point you're gonna have two graham crackers and it might be pulling apart, it might be colliding, it might be sliding against each other. So we're just gonna practice that, okay? At one point you're gonna dunk it in water and I gotta say this, when you dunk it in water, it's a quick dunk. All right, my girls, we like to eat biscotti at home. You guys ever had biscotti? It's like these long cookies and you dunk it in coffee and they're really, really good. But if you dunk it in there too long, it disintegrates and falls into the coffee, you with me? So if you dunk it too long, the graham cracker, it's gonna come up and you're gonna lose it. So you just want a quick dunk so it gets moist and you're gonna set it down. All right, at that point, you're going to have two graham crackers that you're gonna press together and you're gonna watch and see what happens, okay? So, so that's what we got going on at school today, all right? Um, again, wrapping up these assignments, this assignment here, wrapping up that assignment, and once that's done, I'll have that lab online, and then you guys can do that at home. Um, if you don't have the supplies and you want to improvise, that's totally fine. Um, I'm cool with that. So uh, just send me an email, and, and I'll get see if I can get you doing something else. But this is the most fun, and it's kind of fun to eat. Okay? So people at home, that's your plan for today. And everybody here, that's your plan for today. So I'll have this posted online in a little bit. And then uh, y'all in here... If you're ready, we're going to wash tables and get after it, okay? If you're not ready, then keep working.